How's it going, YouTube? Yes, we are finally here. This is the final mission. It's stealing the show on the hardest difficulty setting of Medal of Honor Frontline HD on the PS3. And yes, like I said at the start, we are finally here. And I'm going to be honest, this is actually the easiest level in the whole game. That's my opinion. I thought it was really, really easy. You've got your bazooka. You've got more health kits than you could ever need. You've got loads of grenades. You've got loads of bazooka ammo. If you see something that moves, just blow it up. That's that's how you get through this. It's really, really easy. Like I think I did this on my first attempt. Okay, I had another bit of a mishap with the game audio. It's it's really easy to do it with the Elgato, and I, I did it again. So sorry about that. But you can still watch it and enjoy, can't you? That's that's what we're here for. Woo! But yeah, um, Bazooka. This opening courtyard. There are a lot of enemies in here that you have to take out. But as I said, if it moves. Blow it up. That's that's the best way to do it. And if you take some shots like I have just there, turn around, pick up one of those field surgeon packs, and you will be back to full health. It's that easy, okay, guys? So, as you imagine, when I eventually completed this, I was a happy, happy man. Uh, I completed the entire game on hard. This is the final mission, as I've said. And that's the hardest trophy unlocked for this game. In here, the hangar, there's another field surgeon pack, so you'll never run out of health. These guys in this open courtyard, they will follow you as you can see here, so make sure you've got a gun at the ready. I don't know why I use the pistol here. I it's just I just pulled it out and was like, just shoot them. Just shoot them with a the pistol. That's all I've got, so I'm going to do it, and I'm going to kill them with the pistol. And then I realised grenades is probably a better option, so I start throwing grenades. And I think, you know what? The bazooka's an even better option, so I use that as well, but you can see here when that courtyard's clear, you can abuse the health. There's all... I think... I think enemies continue to spawn. I, I'm not sure, but I think they do. So so you will get people come behind you every now and then. So check your back every on the old occasion. Again, this part here. Grenades. Wipe them out. There's about four or five soldiers there that you can easily take out. And then you move on to the final, final boss. Okay? Who's not hard. It's not difficult. It's not even a challenge. It's just really really easy. Like I say, it's so... In actual fact, it was really disappointing for myself having struggled throughout this game to get to the final mission and just breeze it. I was sort of like, oh. Oh, actually, that's a lie. I was actually like, Wee! I've done it! Wee! Yes, yes, yes! This is what I actually did. But um, on reflection, I think you'd expect the final boss to be the biggest challenge of the game, like uh, Radic from Killzone 2, who did my head in. But here we go. We're going to walk through here. This is the final area of Medal of Honor Frontline HD on the PlayStation 3. I don't know why I say it like that, but I do. But there he is. That's your big boss you got to kill. There's a few soldiers in here again. Again, just throw grenades in there. Blow them all up. There's some explosive barrels you can use. Just as you can see here. I get pretty lucky, to be fair. But throw the grenades. Blow them all up. I'm low on health, so I'm going to run back and get one of the many field surgeon packs and get myself back up to full health. It's, I can't express how easy this was compared to the rest of the game it's it's an absolute breeze do i love this game yes did it annoy me yes is it one of the most irritating games i've ever played yes if i'm honest yes it definitely is on hard difficulty i went back and obviously at the end of this video you will see me get the platinum trophy by picking up the last trophy but after this i obviously went back and played the entire game again on easy so I could get the gold stars which is again another trophy you have to achieve all the medals to get the medals you have to get the gold stars and it's really really simple to get the gold stars you have to kill 95% of all the enemies on each level and there you go that's the final boss dead how easy was that how and that's it i'm i'm literally done and i decided to pick up this health kit here really really easy really Really, really easy. And then you get in that plane. Game over. Job done. Woo! Winner, winner. Chicken dinner. But anyway, as I was saying, you need to kill 95% of the enemies and then finish each level with 75% health. Now, if you drop below, it doesn't matter as long as you finish the level with 75% health, as I did here. And you can see here we've stolen the plane. There's lots of stuff happening, like people dropping bombs and planes flying and stuff like that, which... Back in the day was really impressive. This is really cool. Look at that. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. Not so impressive in this day and age, but that flyby was amazing back in the day. It blew my little mutton, that did. But here we go. We're now taking off, and I think that is it. So we can see here we're going to get another flyby with the, the bombers overhead. We've stolen the jet. 
And we're going to be a little bit cocky, a little bit flash, because apparently I'm a pilot now, as well as being a, a super soldier. We join the Allied forces. Join, join the Allied forces in the air. We're going to fly away, and then a little cutscene. Look at this for a little turn. Here we go. Whoosh. Little, little turn. Whoa. Blow in my, your mind. But anyway, guys, here is the final video. Enjoy. Well done, Jimmy. I couldn't have expected half the results you achieved. So, take some much needed R&R, but rest assured we'll be calling on you soon. With Germany's battle for Russia going poorly on the Eastern Front and our success on the Western Front, Germany is getting less sure and more dangerous by the day. Hitler is turning to projects that we hope never see the light of day. You'll be part of our continuing efforts, Patterson, so rest for now. We'll be in touch. So that's it, we are done and dusted, and we got a gold star on the final mission on hard, Whee! <laughs> Um, yeah, really, really, really pleased as you can imagine guys. What we're going to watch now is me getting the final trophy to get the platinum trophy, I had to get the ET Go Home trophy, I think it's called, uh, basically on track, right at the end of the level, if you look up into the sky, just over here, directly in front of me now, if you look up you'll see a little flash somewhere. And I try to shoot it, and that's it. That's all you have to do. You don't even have to shoot. You just have to look in that rough direction. Then you get the gold trophy, ET going home, and then the platinum trophy. What do you want? A medal, and that's it. That is medal of honor frontline done to 100%. And you can see here, I celebrate like there's no tomorrow. Um, well, all I can say is to you guys, thank you so much for watching. Thanks for your support during this let's play. I know it's been a long time coming. Two years, in actual fact. The next Let's Play won't take as long, trust me, alright? But um, I want to make a call. I want a remake of Medal of Honor Rising Sun now, EA. Rising Sun, do it. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching. I'm Warfields1. That's the Let's Play done and dusted. Ciao for now.